Welcome to the Design Clans podcast. In the previous episode, you learned one of the most important phase when you are building your business on the internet. In this episode, you are going to learn about your superpowers. Using these superpowers, you will be able to create your products and services. I am Santosh, the founder of Design Clans, and the vision of Design Clan is to help you learn how to create and grow your business on the internet. So, what are your superpowers? Everyone in this world is unique. You are unique. There is no one in this world who is like you. That's amazing, right? So all the knowledge and skills you have developed over the years on anything is through your own experiences and your own learning. And that, my friend, is your superpower. So technically, when you're running a business, you don't have any competition because everything you do in your business is going to be unique only to you. And people will love you for who you are. and you will only attract those kind of people into your life or your business so what you have to do is using your superpowers create a good digital product it can be a downlo- downloadable product or it can be a course it's completely up to you but courses are big nowadays so if you are able to create courses using your knowledge then that is going to be amazing so you might be wondering what kind of courses to create So here are some tips for you. Find out what you really really love doing. It can be cooking, gardening, playing games, technology. Maybe uh, you're a health health freak and like uh, you know working out or maybe you're good in uh, nutrition and things like that. Probably you like digital marketing, maybe designing or you are probably a total finance nerd. There is a whole lo- list of things that you can make that you're good at, right? take a piece of paper or maybe open excel or notepad in your system and start creating a list of two things one is what you are already good at two what you love doing take your time to create this list because this list is going to be your future products and services and once you have your list ready ask yourself what are the things in this list you will be able to teach someone without any problem and you must be 100% sure the person who is listening to you will be able to understand everything you teach and here is the most important thing you must be happy doing that because if you are not you probably may make a lot of money in the future but you will not be happy with the process of making it make sense right There is another scenario where you are passionate about a particular subject or a niche but you don't have the knowledge yet. When I say knowledge the knowledge to teach about that subject to someone else. When you teach somebody right you must be absolutely sure of what you're saying. Never teach anyone with half baked knowledge. It's lethal. It is not good. You should always be the student first. If required invest in a quality good course. or you know find a mentor and then learn master it and then teach it this should be the ideal process i love designing and digital marketing that is what my core products are always going to be i am also good in hardware te- uh, technology because of the 8 years i spent in a tech uh, multinational company have worked on computers servers networking and storage devices as well I can teach hardware technology and create good business for myself and I'm pretty sure I'll be flawless at it. But the problem here is I would not enjoy doing that although I have a lot of knowledge in that subject. I had to, you know, learn this because uh, that is what I was doing in my 9 to 6 job before I got into my business. Designing and digital marketing is something I love. One of the most important reason my love towards these two subjects are the way these two connect with the human mind. these two subjects gives uh, the opportunity of understanding the human mind when you get into marketing or designing you will know what i mean and you have to get into it whether you like it or not i have personally went through a lot of courses on designing and digital marketing myself over the years i have learned a lot of tools to simplify designing and marketing for my own business and i've spent more than 9 years doing that and now if i have to teach somebody I will make sure that person masters it to a level I am in. That is something I'll be confident of and I am going to enjoy the enjoy that process because I love what I am doing. I'm not telling you that you have to spend 9 years to master it. All I am saying is if you like something, 
master it it doesn't have to take 9 years it can happen in a span of 2 to 3 months also and once you have mastered it you will be able to teach that to anybody flawlessly and help them master it and that is how you will be able to help people through your products and services and the best part is now you are doing something what you love there will be obvious grind to uh, making few things happen but don't give up and stay consistent so today i would highly encourage you to make that list list of things that you love doing and that list are your superpowers there will be few things which you would like to do and not available so that you can always acquire okay make a list of that as well and plan to get your business on the internet as soon as possible another great thing is when you're creating the list if you did not know what your superpowers are you will know that and it'll be amazing in the next episode you will learn about the next important phase which is building the wonders of your world i hope you got a lot of val- value out of this podcast and i want you to develop your superpowers if you have any comments let me know through one of the social media channels subscribe to the podcast through itunes spotify google podcast or any of the any of your uh, favorite platforms i do two to three podcast a week so make sure you subscribe to my podcast and not miss out whenever i upload any podcast thanks for listening to the design clan podcast i am santosh and have a wonderful day bye